Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel, Jono's Adventure. And today's adventure, well, I've got a little bit of a packing demo for you and another haul. And um, let's just get this thing started. All right. So let's get this going here. Um, what I'm today is Saturday, August the 24th, and I am going on my cruise to um, from uh, from here to Iceland. So it'll be a Northern Europe cruise. Iceland has um, three ports: I land in Reykjavik, I leave on the 3rd of September, I arrive in Reykjavik on the 4th of September, and then the 5th we depart on the Norwegian Prima. And from there, we go to two other ports here in Iceland, and then we travel down into the Norwegian fjords, and we end up, <clears throat> excuse me, in London. So it's a 10-day cruise, so I'm very excited for this. I, I booked this over a year and a half ago, so it's finally coming. <laughs> so I'm still prepping. Um, this, this week, I'm releasing this video here. Um, next week, I will be releasing a um, getting ready. And while I'm on my cruise, I will release another video, which will be the pack with me. And then when I come back, I will be releasing the uh, trip itself. So um, just hang in there. If you're excited to see the Norwegian Prima, if you're excited to see the Norwegian Fjords, and of course, Iceland. I've got some fantastic excursions um, planned and I can't wait to bring them to you. All right, so today's video, I'm gonna start out with a little bit of a demo. I have purchased um, a while back, they're called Eagle Creek um, Packet for Your Garments. And this happens to be a, I think this one's a medium one. Um, this was at the time that I bought this, I think I bought this like, oh, it had to have been like three years ago maybe even more um, that uh, it's a limited print. So they do have different prints, but it's Eagle Creek. Um, and you can just go on to Eagle Creek and look at the patterns. I see some uh, different ones there. Some for the men, of course, that have um, uh, a need to they have them in black, hunter green, they have an, even in a kind of like a hunter pattern. So if I can, I might, um, put a little bit of that on the on this video but I bought this as a set so this is just one of the packing cubes that I have um, from Eagle Creek <clears throat> and I usually use this when I put my cruise ducks in here <laughs> so or anything else that I want for my cabin so I just kind of use this as a catch-all uh, to go into my um, suitcase but this is really interesting. So what I'm going to do is I have um, set out a few uh, shirts and I'll demonstrate this for you how to pack this. Um, this. This is something that I like to use and I don't use it on every cruise. Um, mostly for the war warmer weather cruises, I just use regular rolling methods into a packing cube. But when I have... Um, uh, long sleeve shirts or going into a colder environment. I like to use this because the long sleeve shirts, uh, rolling them for me, I uh, seem to get a little wrinkled. And if they're in the suitcase for a little bit longer than, um, you know, so I'll be packing on and leaving on the third, I'll get to uh, Reykjavik on the fourth, but I won't unpack my suitcase until the fifth. So that being said, it kind of keeps everything really snug and without having it uh, wrinkle. All right, so I'm going to um, get set up and so we'll demonstrate how I use this. All right, so here's the packet cube and it comes folded out like this. And it comes with a little instruction on what to do with this, but it also tells you how to fold. 
and if you're doing pants or shirts and how. So this is folded out like this. So let me, um, because of demonstration purposes, So I have here just a long sleeve shirt. So the instructions, you, you lay out the shirt like this, but you turn it over. So like so, let me see if you can see that. All right, that's a little better. So you, you take this and you put it right up there by the collar. All right, and so the next instruction is you take your sleeves and you bring them over like that and then down. You take your other sleeve, do the same thing like that, bring this down, and then the bottom of the, the cardboard or the plastic thing is there, so you're going to bring this up like that, you turn it over, and you pull this out. So that's, that's that. And then you lay it into the, the packet flat. You can adjust it a little bit if it's, you know, a little bit longer, like that. And then you go to put the next one in. So let's go and do the next one. Here's another shirt I have. So you get the idea. These are the long sleeve shirts. And like I said, they, they do take up room in your suitcase. But if you roll them up and stuff, especially for me, because I'm a bigger girl, I'm five foot nine. And even though I've lost weight, my clothes are still for a tall woman. So it's, this is just for me for, well, I guess there's a little tab here, but um, like that. Again, you just bring it over like that. And you bring this down. Bring this over on this side. And like that. And the bottom it up like that. Take the sleeve out. And <laughs> sorry this is like this guys but it's the best. One. So what I usually do because the collar's on this side and the, it's a little bit thicker on this side I kind of rotate like that. All right. So you see how that goes. So let's do one more. Another long sleeve shirt that I have. Now I'm, I'm demoing the uh, shirts. I don't know if these are the shirts I'll be taking um, on the cruise. I have, I know it's going to be cold. I live in New Orleans where it's, you know, 98 degrees and the humidity feels like 105. And then I'm going to be going up to Iceland, which is going to be in the high 40s and 50s, maybe raining, and so I need to dress warm in layers, kind of like you would do for Alaska. So 
You can do these with sweaters. Um, although sweaters don't seem to wrinkle as much, but just just um, these for shirts. I've got a couple shirts that I'm, you can pretty much pack it as high or thick as you want, any of your long sleeve shirts. So, so this is back to the opposite direction, like that. All right, so then <clears throat> this really holds quite a bit. As you can see, it's kind of a mesh down here. So that's about as thick as you can get. You can get maybe, um, I've gotten as much as like six or seven shirts in this. Um, and I've, I've have packed um, regular short sleeve shirts in this before, uh, just for space saving. But the Velcro here, you can keep it as tight as you want. So you can see it's, it's, it can go quite tight. <clears throat> and it goes like this. And then this just packs packs flat in your suitcase and keeps everything snug. So when you get it out into your where your destination is, which would be my uh, cruise ship. But I think it's a very smart <clears throat> idea and I kind of um, utilize this on this next cruise I'm going on. So, yeah, as I hope you guys showed this. <laughs> anyway, so this is, I forgot to show this. This is, you just pack this inside here and it's um, something you can use if you're going to repack your suitcases to come home. So that's kind of nifty. And it is, it is solid on the back. So it really does, and soft on top. So packing your shirts and uh, blouses, sweaters in this is very handy. And I've seen where um, a demo where they can use a couple of these if you've got more clothes, a longer trip, um, if you're not gonna use your packing cubes. So, all right, so I hope that was a little bit of a demo that I promised last week that I was going to show you something fun. Um, again, that's Eagle Creek uh, Packet Garment, and they come in several sizes and different patterns and colors, so you can mix and match. They also have packing cubes, um, but I, I bought all my packing cubes um, from a different uh, thing, so I'm going to go and get those, and I've got um, a haul to show you guys, so let's do that. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I've become a, a major Amazon buyer. <laughs> I don't know what it's been. I never used Amazon until recently, and all of a sudden I just started. I guess it's because of all those YouTube videos I watch and say, oh, I need that. Oh, that would be good. I'll be good to show on my next video. <laughs> So anyway, to go along with the um, Eagle Creek packing cubes, I went to Amazon and I bought some compression packing cubes. I've never used them, um, but like I said, I'm, I'm trying very hard to space save in my suitcase. Um, just I'm trying to condense down so that I'm only using one. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. Um, but I'm going to try. So um, this is uh, from BagSmart. I got these on Amazon. And they, they come like this. So you unzip the larger one. But look at how much room you have after compression. So you pack this just like a packing cube, and then you compress it. And compression, I mean, you could kind of overpack it, but you don't want to do too much because then you've got this in between here. So then you just sip it like that all the way around, and it compresses like that. So how nifty is that? 
So what I like also is the um, Bag Smart has a little flap right here. And let me reopen this, I'll show you. So this is the this is just the opening of this, um, not the compression. Well, it comes with little uh, tags, and you can put the tags in to describe what you're packing in here. So I think that's kind of another nifty idea. You just have to use different ones, but it comes with the one I got. So it comes with a, a bag. Now this is kind of what they think of a, as a shoe bag. I think it's for your shoes. So that's this bag and it comes with this. It comes with two of the longer ones. Now these are like for your underwear or socks or anything like that. And then um, this, so that's three, this bag, four, and five. So a six piece. So like I said, this is, this is the bag, very deep. Got lots of room in there, the bigger bag. Unzip it all the way. What I like about these, now some of the packing um, compression cubes are just kind of like a half flap and you have to kind of tuck things in and what i liked about this is just a full wide open um, so you can really layer and fold um, you know compact enough and then once that's done then you zip it up so now you've zipped up your clothes in the in this bag and then you compress it and the compression brings it down just like that so it's very nice i i think i'm going to really get some good use out of it i don't know if you can see this i think i'm putting this on the table and you're not seeing it let me, let me replay this. So I just replayed it so I can see. I think I did okay showing you this. Um, and for storage purposes, all the bags fit in here into the larger one, and then you just keep it compressed. So nifty. I'm, I'm excited to use this. When I go to do my packing, um, I'll show you all the bags that I ended up using and um, how it fits in my suitcase. <laughs> so anyway, I have, I'm still trying to decide how I'm packing. I, I, I will do this next weekend because I've got to get it all done, but um, I will definitely show you guys. All right, so next, these are my trusty, these are from eBags. Now I, I've had these for quite some time um, this is what I have been using for all my packing. Uh, not that they're not any good versus the um, compression. I think it's just whatever you can use to keep your uh, clothes organized in your suitcase. And um, like I said, if, I, if I'm going and it's just a short trip, like in January, I'm going on another cruise here out of New Orleans. And um, so I'm not going to be traveling other than from my house to the ship. So um, I'll board that same day. I don't really need to worry about um, my clothes getting that wrinkled or being in a suitcase that long. So I plan to do that. Anyway, so that's the utilizing these. This, this came, this is like I said, this is e-bags. They have different patterns, different, different uh, sets, but I got two sets of three. So this is the, the larger one. And what I've always done in the past is in the larger one, because like I have two sets, so I have two large ones. The first large one will get the, uh, the, the day wear, 
and the larger one will get the um, the evening wear because that's what I do. I change, and so that they all fold in there nice and neat. And then of course, if I have tops and things, they'll be in the the other uh, Eagle Creek packing. So the large one's quite roomy. It, like I said, doesn't compress, but it does fit quite a bit in there. And then I have um, the next size down is this one. And I usually just put in here, um, if I want to put like my swimsuits and cover up, um, I'm, this isn't a warm weather cruise, so I probably won't have other than what I'm wearing for the Blue Lagoon. I am taking a swimsuit, obviously. Um, might get into the jacuzzi, whatever, but that's what I use this one for. The second set will be, um, you know, underwear and socks. And then I have also this. So I do utilize six of these. <laughs> so it just, um, and I'll show you how I pack them, but this is just another packing set of cubes that I have um, that I utilize while I'm packing. Again, like I said, I, I bought these quite some time ago. Um, so I have two sets, two sets of three, and they have done me well. So anyway, those are, those are the um, packing cubes that I'm gonna utilize, these here, and then the, um, also the um, Eagle Creek. All right, so next I'm going to show you a few things that I've gotten. Um, the, these are my last hauls that um, I'm, I've got from preparing for my cruise. So on the plane, I have never used headphones. I've always used the earbuds and you've got the, the cord that attaches to the, um, the plane so I can watch videos or entertainment or whatever. I don't run my phone. I usually utilize whatever the plane has. But I bought um, some wireless headphones and it's from the company G-L-Y-N-Z-A-K. I didn't get really expensive headphones because, like I said, this is probably something that I'm just going to use on the plane when I travel. But I got it in rose gold, and it, I think they're quite comfortable. They're Bluetooth. Let's see if I can match my big head like that. They're not noise canceling, but if you've got these things on and I'm watching a movie, then um, I, I'll be fine. And it has, um, for sound, you got the plus and minus, and you also have a little cord here so you can, um, it comes with, you know, so you can attach it if you don't use your Bluetooth. But... Along this same line is the, um, now I don't have a case for this, so I'm going to figure out something. Um, right now I'm just putting it in the box. The wireless headphones. Um, you can uh, charge them. Music talk time, 65 hours. Uh, charging time, two and a half hours. And um, so that's, I think those are going to be just fine. But along with this, I found another uh, YouTube person. Like I said, I watch YouTube and I'm going other creators. And um, she featured this and I said, what a neat idea. So it's instead of using, well, you can use your earbuds, but I have the wireless headphones. This is... Um, it's called Airfly, and it's, it looks just like that. It comes in a little pouch, and you hook this to the entertainment center, and it hooks just like that, and it's YouTube. Uh, not YouTube. <laughs> it's wireless, so it, go, it goes into your headphones, so you can hear whatever's the entertainment. So... This way I'm not having to 
get those earbud things for that. Um, this does have a, a charging cord that comes with it. And um, I just thought this was really, really neat. Um, it does show a picture, how it looks. So they're showing your, with your AirPods, but with your, um, you just stick that in your back seat of your um, entertainment and got your headphones on and you don't have to have this big old cord hooked to your ears. Um, I, for me, it's a new idea. Maybe everybody has one or they, they use their Bluetooth. I don't know, <laughs> but for me, it was, I'm just getting with it, I guess. But I, I just think this is something I'm going to be utilizing for my uh, long haul. I, so I, that's what I bought from um, Airfly. And then this is the um, wireless headphones. So if you already have wireless headphones, then these are, these are nifty. So I think I can uh, utilize this quite well. And it's, I'll just have to make sure I know how to use it. So when I get on the plane, I'm not reading instructions. <laughs> uh, I'm a grandma after all, right? Okay, so the next thing I've got um, I just bought these. Now I had to open it up. This is a, um, these are a waterproof foam pouches. Um, it's sensitive to the touch. I, my, I have an iPhone 15 fits in here. Perfect. It, it, I'm able to turn my phone on. I can, push the camera button and that. So I think that's going to be pretty nifty. It comes with an attachment so you can um, attach it to your phone. Um, I tested this not only with the size of my phone, but I also put a um, paper towel in here and um, closed it up. It's just got little, little, um, do it right. little clamps here and you just clamp it like that. And I put it underwater for um, 30 minutes and the paper towel was dry. So I think this will be something that I can utilize. Now I'm going to the Blue Lagoon and I really wanted to film for you guys. So I think I'm gonna utilize this. Um, that way I'm not holding my phone up like this the whole time. So I might be able to do this and that, but, um, but right now this is my idea for that. Like I said, it came in a pack of two, a black one and a, a turquoise color one. And this is just an Amazon purchase. All right. So I, I do Ipsy. I get Ipsy every other month. I thought I'd just show you. It comes in a really cute little packing they have an opportunity that, okay, you're getting five items, but if you want to add something to it, you can go to the Ipsy website or, you know, you're hooked up to it and you can go through their products and see if there's something else you want. So my um, sixth item I chose this time, I just went through it and um, got a little brow pencil. So um, that was my, and I think this is only like a dollar ninety nine extra or something. So there's different products and different prices. You can get a full size product for something um, and it, you know, just extra charge. So, but a lot of times I look for the extra product that's perfume because you get the little tiny ones. It's like this, this size. And then I order that, but always comes in a, oh, I know what else I ordered. I ordered this bag. Um, I have somebody I'm going to be uh, gifting, so I'm I'm going to put some little things in here for her. So that's that's why I got that one. So that's the two I, extra items that I got of the five. But this month's bag is is kind of a um, pink and it's got glam. So these bags are really nifty to use for all your packing and anything like that, uh, anything extra which I, I utilize. I have them in my bag for work. I have one that has, you know, just extra things, lip gloss and some hand sanitizer. I put one in my uh, carry-on and um, 
my personal item bag so that I have something I can use to refresh myself before I get off the plane. So I utilize these bags all over the place. But I also, I get quite a few of them. So I'll take a bunch of them and I'll donate them. Um, I'll take them to work and I just say, hey, free for all. And um, let the other ladies enjoy as well. So let's see what we got here. It also comes with a card. Um, they're calling it the Beauty Olympics, I guess because um, the Olympics are over. And so it tells you what you're getting for August. So I got from Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. So it's a little, little tiny one here. And I got from Stone Street Soap House uh, Body Souffle. So isn't that nice? So these are little products that I can take when I travel and just use them in the shower and, and that. Okay, so anyway, this is um, something to use. And then it came with also from Mana. It's um, Flawless Finish Dual Powder. So I have a lot of times if I get something that I don't use, that's what I gift. Okay, I need good stocking stuffers. <laughs> Sorry, I do this here. Here we go. And I get brushes from them too. So it's a nice little powder. Like I said, it's a finishing powder. I also got, you know, this is pretty, some uh, lip tint. And the last thing of the five I got is um, some eye cream. So I do utilize a lot of eye cream. Um, I think I featured this uh, on what's in my makeup bag, but it's just a small sample, so to speak. So this is good for travel. So just put a little cream on my, um, under my eyes. So how nice is that? So I'm glad I got to show you guys this time. With, so this eye cream, the body souffle, Estee Lauder advanced night repair, and some lip, and then some finishing powder. And then my extra was the brow pencil, and I got another little bag. Anyway, Ipsy. All right, so my last purchases, let me grab them. I just got these last week too, and you'll see them because every night when I, or whatever I'm wearing that day, I feature that on my video, what, you know, what I'm wearing, what jewelry. So I bought this, I thought this was so pretty. It's from SESE Code. This is also from Amazon, but it really looks sharp on. It's got, um, it's got a, like an underliner, but the sleeves are wispy. And I think this is going to look really sharp for one of my evening wear. So I'm kind of excited about this one. So what happened though, when I got um, from Amazon, um, <laughs> I, I got, I ordered extra large, but they gave me a medium. So Amazon's return policies are so super easy. Uh, we have a whole food shop here, our store here. And um, after I'm done videotaping this, I got to run and return um, the medium. But I went ahead, when I saw I got a medium and I wanted this so bad, I went ahead and turned around and bought it again. Um, and they gave me the extra large. So they gave me the right size this time. But I do have a, a, a black pair of pants that I can wear with this, but I also have a um, green this, that this will really look sharp with. So I'll, I'll feature that as well, whatever I'm gonna wear it with. But um, so I got that. And the only other piece of clothing that I've gotten from them, um, from Amazon, I got a white top. It's a, a tunic. So just something really simple and um, also an extra large. And 
So those are the two pieces that I got. So I think I'm ready to pack everything and get on this cruise. <laughs> no more, no more buying for right now. I think I've got, I think I'm set. So, all right, let me uh, finish this off for you guys. All right, everybody. I want to thank you all for hanging in there to watch all this stuff. And I hope you liked the little bit of packing demo that I um, was able to give you. I did promise that last week that I was going to show you this. So these are just the uh, last minute hauls that I um, was able to purchase this last week and um, wanted to feature them also. So really looking forward to this cruise. I'm hoping you're looking forward to watching it. And I want to thank you again for watching uh, and sticking with it to the end. Um, give this video a thumbs up. I appreciate that. Comment if you have any questions or need uh, just to comment and say you like my stuff. And also um, share. Uh, if you know somebody that's going on a cruise and maybe something that I've shown here, um, maybe they might be interested in it as well. But all three of those things plus subscribing helps this algorithm go out there. I'm at 623 as of this video. So I'm, um, I'm steadily increasing my um, subscribers, which is the whole, whole thing you want to do. Um, but I, I just do it for the joy of it, actually. And if I get more subscribers, then I'm happy to even give you guys more content. So, all right. So I'm going to close this off. It's probably already long enough. And in the meantime, whatever you're doing today, I hope you're having a good day. I hope you're being safe. And until my next video, I'll see you then. Love you all. Bye-bye.